Hi everyone, I'm India and I'm from Australia. I grew up here. Um, we're just in the fossil fields and I've just found a nice big ammonite. So it's about 80 million years old, or in between 40 and 80 million years old. And then we've got a nice shell here. Yeah, we're just going to have a poke around for the rest of the day. Alright, so I'm going to get a sun flare if we go through this way, but this is basically the country that we're um, looking for fossils in. Yeah. Over there there's a bit of a sign that says a fossil find, so that's given us a clue that we're in the right spot. But if you come to Giralia, you can come out here and do this as well if it takes your fancy. India just found that and we basically came to the spot and <laughs> took her a minute. There are lots of fragments around. We see a lot of these things quite often. Okay, so this is Duralia's receiving room so when you first come to Duralia you get greeted here and the guys organise where you're going to camp and so forth. Um, there's a little bit of art and other information around the place and there's a lot of history about the station and there's a dog in the background too. Hey guys so we're back at Duralia Homestead this is the Duralia Museum where all our stuff is. Um, I just thought I'd talk to you about some of the fossils that have been found and a bit about the Australia Ranges, where we found the fossils. Um, so these are some of the fossils that have been found along the Australia Range. Um, they were found in the northern and southern Carnarvon Basin, which is where we were. Um, and the rock type found there is a carbonate Cretaceous rock. And so that is from the Cretaceous period, about 66 and 83 million years ago. Um, and yeah, I'll talk to you, show you a few of the fossils that have been found. So this is the ammonite we showed you. So it used to have a nautilus in it. Um, and here's some more fragments of other ones that people have found. And this is a different species of ammonite. Yeah, which is pretty cool. And then we've also found some shells. And a bivalve shell as well, which is really interesting. It used to have these spines coming off it, which kind of kept it above some clay off the ground to protect itself. And um, we've also had the West Australian Museum people come out here and they found a radius of a pterodactyl. And its wingspan would have been about five metres long, which is pretty incredible. Um, and I also found a shark tooth. So it's from a giant great white shark, about 66 million years old, which is pretty incredible. Um, so yeah, if you guys come to Australia, this will be one of the few things that you can do out here, um, other than the fishing, the full driving and bird watching. So yeah, hope to see you here.